Westlake Royal PVC trim and molding products have been bringing advanced performance, versatility, aesthetics, and breadth of choices to customers for over 50 years. Royal PVC products have you covered from roofing to the water table with ready-to-install exterior moldings, smooth edge and sheet trim board project completers, interior trim components, and garage weather sealing and trim solutions. Here's why homeowners and pros alike choose Royal Trim and Molding for their projects. All products are waterproof, so products can be used above or below grade, durable and strong while being lightweight, made of moisture and termite-proof PVC material, so every product is low maintenance, compatible with our select or vinyl offerings or other brands like Hardy or LP, easy to install, cut, and machine with standard woodworking tools hundreds of unique shapes that nail without splitting or cracking. Covered by a limited lifetime, no rot warranty. And Royal Trim products are made in the USA. You get to know Westlake Royal Trim and Molding, an ever-expanding collection of interior and exterior products that deliver beautiful, durable design solutions for every home project. Now let's take a look how to use Royal PVC Trim Solutions to add designer low-maintenance porch columns to your home. With products available in a wide variety of profiles, thicknesses, and lengths, a project like this is a snap. We'll be making columns, bases, and capitals for each post using butt joints and miter joints. First, cut a set of four trim boards about one half inch shorter than your porch posts. Next, make two L-shaped but jointed trim board sets for each porch post you will wrap. Use PVC cement on the joining edges and secure with finishing nails at 16-inch intervals. And then countersink the finish nails. Now it's time to wrap your posts. First, align one of your L-shaped sets with a post and countersink two and one half inch screws every 16 inches on just one side of your column wrap. Next, add the other L-shaped trim board set. Use pipe cement on each joint edge. And secure with finishing nails every 16 inches. Next, add a base to each post. Cut four 1x8 trim board pieces. Apply cement to each butt joint edge. And press into place. Secure each base you create with finishing nails. Miter cut and add the base cap and quarter rounds to your bases. Dry fit each piece to verify your measurements, then glue. Secure your base caps and quarter rounds into position with finishing nails. Using a compound miter saw, cut four crown board sections to make your capitals. Dry fit your crown boards to verify your measurements, and then glue into place. Next, secure your crown molding with finishing nails. Lastly, caulk all seams with exterior latex caulk. Fill the nail holes with DAP all-purpose painter's putty and paint with vinyl safe latex acrylic paints as needed. And now your column wrap project is complete.